Right, hello everybody. I just want to ask you all the well, just want I just want you all to what's the word I'm looking for? I want to ask you all a question. Should I install Windows 8 Consumer Preview over Windows 7? Like the whole OS over another because I can install it now. Copy it over Windows 7. I can install it on another partition, but I need to buy a disk. But uh, I can't make a made partition. You know my disk isn't very big, so that's my partition there. It's only twenty five gig. That's all you, that's all you need. But, you know, you got this shit that doesn't appear to work. Don't know why that ever existed? Yeah, what am I gonna do? Should I install? Is Windows seven, Windows eight worth installing over Windows seven? Should I? Because things like Sony Vegas, Photoshop. Audacity, emulators, all this shit has to work. There's no, you can't just like, hope it works. And if it doesn't, oh well. It has to work. I ain't got a choice. So I'm really worrying. Like, I want to install. I want to see it. But I don't want to buy ten, like spend ten quid for a DVD or a USB to copy the shit onto. I might, but I don't want to. And plus, if I do, I won't have any much space for anything anyway. So. I don't know what the hell I'm going to do. So if anyone could leave what I think I should do, if I should stay to Windows 7 and wait for Windows 8 to come out in October, put that. If you think I should just stay Windows 7 altogether, put that. Anything is appreciated. What the hell Steam's doing? Downloading something. Yay. Thank you, guys. Goodbye.